Second half of runs so far as Becky Hammond keeps it going. Big shot, Becky. This 31-year-old point guard basketball player received this nickname for her ability to fire home decisive throws. Often a match winner for the San Antonio Silver Stars WNBA team, in 2007 Becky Hammond had her best career season. By the end of it she had an impressive 18 and 8 points per game rate and was nominated for the league's most valuable player. But all of a sudden both her life and career gave a rather unexpected twist. She moved to the Russian CSKA club, received a Russian passport, and quickly made it into the Russian national Olympic team. I really came into Russia with an open mind. Um, just wanted to take in the culture, the people, try to learn a little bit of the language, which is very difficult. <laughs> I made this decision a long time ago, and I'm happy with the decision that I made. I live my life, and I, and I play basketball for God first. And if he's happy with my decision, and he's made this way for me and this opportunity for me, um, then I'm, that's all I'm concerned with. Becky says that it was the Olympic dream which eventually justified her decision, as she feared she wouldn't make it into the United States Olympic squad for the Beijing Games. That was always a dream of mine growing up was to play for the United States, but um, you know, as you get older, and uh, I, I'm not somebody who lets a lot of opportunities slip away. You know, they have a, a hard decision to, to pick their team, and I understand that, but um, I'm thankful to be here in Russia and be playing for Russia and, and uh, you know, have teammates that I really enjoy. Before the Americans' arrival, some said that it's experienced point guards that the Russian national team strongly lacked. And Becky has already proved she could fill that gap with decent performances. It seems she had no big problem gelling with her teammates. Well, Becky has just arrived to the team, but obviously there are lots of Russians in this team. I wonder if she has any language problems with her teammates, and I'm going to find out right now. Hello. Do you have any language problems with Becky? No, we have no language problems with Becky. She has spent some time here already. Besides, she has already played in the Russian club for a year, so we understand each other well. Well, things are looking good for the latest player to join the Russian squad. But Becky's transition to the team was not that easy. After she changed the sides of the Atlantic, the same people who doubted her participation in the Olympic Games for the United States lashed out at her for making the move. Head coach Ann Donovan's criticism divided the nation into those who thought her a traitor and those who said she was just following the Olympic dream. If you play in this country, live in this country, and you grow up in the heartland, and you put on a Russian uniform, you're not a patriotic person in my mind. It is unfathomable to me. But this rhetoric does not seem to concern the player now. Words hurt a little bit, you know, but uh, I take into consideration, you know, she comes from a different generation and, um, you know, she's, she's been very nice in the whole USA basketball, the players, the coaches have all been very nice to me, so uh, it's kind of water under the bridge at this point, just let it go. The big question is what will Hammond feel should Russia meet the United States in the course of the Olympics? But Big Shot Becky says that what's on court stays on court, and it's sport after all. Alexey Roshevsky, RT, Bay.